Hello everybody, it's great to see you all today. I have all this filled with empty products. Some of them great, some of them not so great. I'll tell you about them as we go through. Let's get started. Okay? This is something I have repurchased until they discontinued it. They no longer have this. This is the L'Oreal Paris Silky Sheer Face Lotion. It's wonderful sunscreen under makeup, and it's an SPF of 50. They no longer carry this product, but it is outstanding. It lasted, it lasted me one year. Excellent product. I have the Coconut and Lime Sugar Scrub from Tropical Fruits. And this I got at TJ Maxx, and it was a wonderful scrub. I do like the sugar scrubs. I feel like they're more moisturizing on the skin. The salt scrubs are a little bit drying, but they are still exfoliating. These sugar ones are the ones that I prefer because they moisturize a little bit better, as well as exfoliate. So this was a good one. I got this at TJ Maxx. This one I've had for years, ever since my children were little. Aquaphor, original dry skin ointment. It's just like Vaseline. There's nothing left. It is outstanding. It's even better than Vaseline. So on the same idea, um, we use this for everything. When the children were smaller, we used it for everything. And I still used it for my lips, any dry spots in my face. It's a wonderful product. Okay, my Dove Sensitive Skin Soap. I use this to wash my face in the mornings, wash my face at night after I take off my makeup. I have sensitive skin, and I love the fact that this is fragrance-free. It's an outstanding product. It lathers, it doesn't strip the skin, yet it, moist, it keeps in moisture, and it cleanses the skin. It's just the perfect soap. I just think it's the perfect soap. I keep repurchasing that again and again. And I got a sample of this, thinking it would be really, really good. It says it's the Dove Dry Oil Moisture Nourishing Body Wash. It wasn't that moisturizing you. I Nothing to write home about. This Dove Dry Oil Moisture Nourishing Body Wash is not very good. It wasn't good. My Pond's Cold Cream, I use this in the evenings to remove my makeup. It's outstanding. I repurchased it for the past 20 years. I love this. This is an amazing product. and it removes all the makeup thoroughly and then after I do that I just wash my face with my Dove sensitive skin soap and okay now this one I love this is the Chic Intuition picture of it maybe in the front it you don't need shave cream it already has the moisture in it it's a great product I've been repurchasing this for the past five years uh, it's never cut my legs I shave every other day I shave my legs and it leaves them smooth and silky, don't need shave cream, don't need gel, anything. Comes with the shave cream here, and it's an outstanding product. My Almay Eye Makeup Remover Pads. Now, I have very sensitive eyes. I have not been able to use anything but these. This is the oil-free version Almay. It's known for, um, you know, being good for sensitive eyes. You know, it doesn't irritate the eyes, and it removes all the makeup. One pad for each eye. I flip it over, use up all the pad, and then do it again on the other eye. Oh, my Anastasia Brow Mascara in granite. This is outstanding. A gray that, a gray here, here and there that I might have in my eyebrow. It covers it. It's a tinted brow gel from Anastasia, and it's. There's other brands that have these, but Anastasia seems to understand the ethnic hair coloring because she's got this granite. It is a cool toned grayish brown black and it's outstanding if you're Lebanese like myself, Italian, if you're Greek. Anybody would enjoy this. Anastasia, she knows her colors. And my Holy Grail um, treatment is the Hydra Shield Moisturizing Face Serum by Dr. Dines. It's an outstanding product. I've repurchased this time and again. Use it morning, I use it in the evening. It has balanced my skin. It's outstanding. Okay. Oh, I finished up my Alme, no, I'm sorry, my Maybelline um, concealer. Fit Me Maybelline. It's a wonderful concealer. It's an excellent drugstore concealer, one of the best. Love the product. 
I'm not repurchasing that for now because I have others I'd like to use up. I got a sample of the Bobbi Brown BB Cream with an SPF of 35. This is a wonderful product. I used it up, had a sample, and it's excellent. But I've got the It Cosmetic CC Cream, and I want to use that up before I repurchase anything else. Lipstick, one of my favorite colors. This was a Bare Minerals lipstick. They've since discontinued the color. It's called Berry Cordial. It's an out, It's just a beautiful berry tone that was very, very flattering on the lip. I wonder if I can maybe scrape a little bit more out of there. I'm going to see if I can do that. It's really great color. My deodorant, my husband and I both use this. The Toms of Maine in Fresh Apricot. That's the, the scent I like. Really super deodorant, all natural, and it provides good protection. My Reach Mint Wax Floss. Love this. This is my favorite floss from the drugstore. Use it all the time. In fact, there's two in here. Really, it's very important to floss your teeth. I'm sure you all know that. My favorite um, base coat for the nails is the Orly Bonder. That is, I've repurchased that time and again. It's a wonderful base coat. It's a rubberized base coat. And it, I find it la keeps your nail polish on. It's the best tip base coat. It is expensive. It is at the drugstore, but it is it, 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 as expensive as a high-end base coat. It is excellent, however. Okay, I used up my Help Me Philosophy Retinol Night Treatment. This was not great. It was okay. It was drying. I had to put a lot of moisturizers with this. It wasn't easy to apply. It wouldn't spread. I would not recommend the philosophy retinol night treatment. It was not easy to use and it was just very drying on the skin. So, and last but not least is my Sephora lip pencil. I like these pencils. I think Sephora sells them for five dollars. I can't even see the color on this one because it's really dead. The formula of the Sephora lip pencils are excellent for five dollars they're excellent formula and they work very well they're very the colors are really deep and I recommend this from Sephora not a lot of Sephora brand products that I like but this one is a real winner the, the lip pencils lip liners the lip liners okay so I think that's everything I want to click on um, face of the day I'm using today the it cosmetic CC cream because it has an SPF of 50 and just phenomenal coverage I have that on my uh, face today concealer is my Revlon age defy concealer in light medium it has since been discontinued sorry about that I have my usual Anastasia Brow Wiz in granite and my Anastasia Brow Gel in granite as well. I have my Chanel Powder Universal as a powder to set the makeup. My blush is my favorite blush, the Purple Lab Blush in 6 inch heels. It has since been discontinued. Sorry about that. On my eyes, my eyeliner is my e.l.f. Waterproof Pen Eyeliner in coffee and coffee it's a wonderful liquid liner pencil and you can get it at the drugstore and it comes in just two colors black and brown and this one's in coffee and it's outstanding it's like $2.99 and then on my eyes I have my Lorac Pro palette as with my elf prism palette I can show you what I have there I have today is the peach peach color from the prism palette it's beautiful peach thought it went well with my blouse and here I just mixed both colors the mauve and the taupe I mixed together in the crease and under the brow I have the cream color the cream color over there okay and I'm off my son is getting its awards night at my son's school he's in eighth grade and he'll be getting awards as well as playing in the jazz band tonight. So I'm off to see him do that. So anyway, have a wonderful day, and I appreciate all those who watch. Bye-bye.